having a good day. Welcome back to Savage for Gaming with me, Teddy. And for this video, we are going to play the New Year's Eve party. So we have to remember the anniversary event, or not the anniversary event, but the November event where we played the stitches for a chance to win a free HP skin. This is pretty similar to that. But of course, they change a few mechanics on how you're going to get or have a chance to get the HQ skin and at the same time some other information for this event. So without further ado, let's go down to business. But before that, if you find the videos that I'm posting or I'm uploading here, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe because uh, like as well as your subscribing will help me grow this channel as well. Thank you guys. Alright, so first off, let's check out the different skins for this month's skin event. So you will have your Chinese uh, or Dragon City Happiness that will give you 2.50 trip attack and then you will have the Dragon City of Luck that will only give you 2% you can get this from playing the New Year's Eve party so these uh, Dragon City Happiness is for daily ranking and the event ranking for the first of, of 1 to 5 we're going to check that out in a few minutes after this one so the March skin will be the flying dragon which you're probably going to get by the top up of 30,000 high cups and then the frame you can also get it from the lucky dog this will be the new year's eve i think it is a clover title for you all right so for this title we're going to talk about this one next time where you are going to get this and at the same time, the other achievements or the patches that you can post on your profile. So pretty similar to the November's event where you need to kill the stitches for you to get a chance to win an HK skin. This time, you will also have the same mechanics, but they have added three different monsters. The ranking will be the same. You will have your daily rankings, your event ranking, and at the same time, the glory rankings. Your daily ranking will be the ranking of how many points you made each day. And for the top 1 to 5, you will get a Dragon City of Luck, Friendship or Skin Friendship Permanent. I think this one is you can gift to another player. This is giftable. The ones that you're going to win for the daily ranking, you can gift this to other players. And then 6 to 10 will also have a Lux Dragon City Luck HP Skin Friendship Permanent. And once you have that, you can also give it to another player. But you remember that you can re-gift it or withdraw it once you already give that. So for every day from rank 1 to 10 for the daily rankings, 10 players can get this permanent skin. For you to get a chance to also uh, gift it to other players. For the event ranking, for the total ev event, for the entire duration of the event, the rewards for one, top 1 to 10 will be the Dragon City Happiness Permanent Skin. This one is not giftable. And then 11 to 50, you will have a Dragon City Luck, and you can, this one is a giftable HQ skin. And then for 51 to 200 ranking for the entire event, you will get uh, skin tickets as well as buy cups and then speed ups. The glory ranking is the listings of the players who are able to win or kill the Nian beast. So this beast is what you are going to kill instead of November stitches. You will have the dragon, the dragon beast to kill for you to get a chance and HP skin. So how are we going to play this event? So this event got three different monsters. You have the infected that will drop rewards and killing the infected will also give you valuable rewards. Of course, the rarer the infected, the more valuable the rewards because these infected can get to level 1 up to level 2. So the second monster that you also need to know is the Pyromaniac that will give you the contribution points for the prize pool and it will open randomly once the Spyro is being killed. And the player who successfully opens the prize pool will receive all the rewards. 
So this is the prize pool. Once you have a chance to reach a certain or a fireman that is being killed, whoever unlocks that will have a chance to win the pool rewards. So each attack adds one contribution point and so one is to one. One firecrackers is cause to one contribution points. Next, next is your neon beast that spawns at a fixed time each day. And then once you have a chance to kill this, you will get a permanent H skin. So this is where we are going to focus on when you are going to use your items at how or what time you are going to drop all your items. Last but not least that drops a free rewards as well is the chest reward drops during reset. So this timer here guys shows you that in 4 hours and 21 minutes your crate is going to help in and then you will get a chance to win the Dragon City Luck as well as a badge or chief gear crates, chief badge, gear gear, as well as speed ups and then some bike ups. But of course, like I said, all of these events usually runs by RNG or random number generator. So it depends on your luck. So for you to win this one, make sure to click this crate at zero UTC or upon or upon reset. Usually I open this at or make sure that I have my finger at zero one second before the reset and then auto click it at reset time for you to get a chance to win the HQ skin. So how are you going to get a chance to win that HQ skin for the beast? This what the Drones and Dragon HQ skin. For you to win that you need to make sure that you killed the beast at certain times so 4 UTC, 8 UTC, 12 UTC and 16 UTC and if you are going to check the leaderboards here it is pretty similar to the previous uh, stitches game so if you see 16, 12, 4 and then 20 UTC and then 16 so at the hour you have 1 to 10 seconds from, for example, we are going to talk about 16 UTC. So you have from 16 UTC up to 10 seconds of that for you to get a chance to win the Dancing Dragon HQ skin. And this is permanent. Alright, last but not least is either you are going to use a normal attack or you are going to use the Rage. So this one runs in RNG or random number generator. So if the probability of the rewards is one is to one, so I'd rather use the rich one instead of the normal one. Uh, because technically when I made a test, I have two account statistics, the rich one gives more points than doing the normal ones. But it depends probably when you're going to click or attack the infected. So for this one, let's try to click the infected here, that's level 1. And let's wait for the other one to come. So this is another level 1. And once that infected is close, you need to reach attack it really, really fast, guys. This is what you're going to do with the beast if the beast is going to come out at the hour. And because you only got like 10 seconds for you to have a chance to win that HQ skin. So once the infected or the monsters come out, make sure to click that rage button there as fast as you can. Alright, so that's it for today guys. And like I said, I know I've been missing a lot of reading guys. I owe you guys from the Mining Mayhem and at the same time for the Miko 4. I will try to publish all of those writings on my website by tomorrow. Alright, see you in my next videos and have a good day. Bye!